Hello everybody, this is the White Hand here, and we're back with another playthrough. Ultra Sun. Hell yes, I am so excited. Uh, I don't know how good this sounds. Um, I kind of went on a tantrum and I like I ransacked my house looking for my uh, my my USB for my uh, capture card, and I was stupid and, and I, I forgot I can I can just use any micro USB for it, but. Let's continue. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can, is this sound alright? Alright, let's do it. I'll turn it up a little. I don't know which one I should turn up. I guess, like, I don't know if that affects anything. I'm in a slightly different setup. So we'll see. I don't know. Can I turn it down from here? I don't know. I don't know. Who cares? Let's get right into it. Begin, uh, begin game. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Look at that serving Pikachu! Your settings have been saved. Message from the lovely region's own Professor Kukui. Just like the other one. What's up, brother? Hang on now, just give me a sec. Hey there, good afternoon. The day has finally come that you're moving to Alola. Alola is a region made of several islands. That could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon, yeah. There's no shortage of cool Pokemon here, out here in Alola either. I think my dog's in here. Oh no, it's Tamara! Get out! Hold on a second. Interruptions. Sorry about that. I, kind of, I may have messed up my recording there a little bit because I, I, uh, I hit pause recording too many times. But. Uh, recap. Okay, it's, it's Kukui. Such mysterious creatures. It's a rock rough. You'll find them all over in the grass, in the caves, in the sky, in the sea. Here in Alola, we love our Pokemon, and we depend on them heaps too. There's a cutie fly. I wasn't there before. Some of us even battle with them. If we call ourselves Pokemon trainers, rock rough, cutie fly. I'll play with you later. So cool, your jets. All right, I gotta ask you some questions about yourself, so I can introduce you to everybody. So which photo should I use for your trainer passport? Oh yeah. Time to get time to get snazzy looking. Uh uh Let's go with I go with this, this one for now, I guess. Yes. Alright then I'll spell your name out for me. Ugh. Can't talk. Uh, a D... No, damn it. I'm still having the same problem with my, uh, my DS. This is not a different DS. This is the same crappy one I've been using for all my playthroughs. It has a really messed up, uh, uh, like, has really messed up, uh, setup on the, uh, touchpad. Uh, okay, Adam. There we go. So you go by Adam. Yes, I do. Ten four, good buddy. I'll let everybody out here know you're on your way. Adam. Hey, look, there's that's a familiar face. Yeah, that's a name that just hits you like a trap kick right in the head. Woo! Ric Flair. Can't wait to see you in person, cousin. That's cool. I really hope this is not gonna be laggy, because Sun and Moon was kinda laggy. Ooh, look at that. Adam, come help me with these boxes. Oh shit, you gotta go. Aether Foundation. I wonder how this is going to be different. Movement in the background. Lily running. Is it me or does this look better? Like graphically. Are, are the uh, Ultra Recon Squad going to interrupt? Yeah, they, there they are. What the hell? Nope, never get through the get her the hell out of there. Peace out. <laughs> Ultra Sun. Hell yeah. Holy shit, look at that. It's all prismy. I mean I'm so excited. I wanna know I wanna know what the hell's going on three months later.
Is that a Mele Mele Island? Looks like it. I wonder if anything... I mean, things have obviously changed. Like, am I still new here? Or is it... Was it like three, three, three months later for me, too? There's a... Ooh, there's a little Lillian Meow from the trainer. Cool. Hopefully there's no echo. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a Wingle. There's our mom. Ah, you can just take uh, feel that warmth. The first day, uh, first day spent under the Alola, uh, under Alola sun. It's a woman right here. Well, that's enough of that. Time to unpack all these boxes. Meow, go get Adam for me, would you? Meow. That'd be cool if you could train that thing. I would like to have that thing on my team. I really hope there's no echo. That would suck. Whoa, look at that! Poly World map, uh, Matt. See that point? That's awesome. Snorlax, Pello. There's a switch. <laughs> Who's that autograph from? From I want to. I want to know. There's a Pikachu plush. This is definitely different. They've uh, they've they've changed things. That I want that mat. Give me that mat. Whoa. Pincer, uh, pincer, uh, bed, bedspread. Oh, what? Oh, time for me to get up. Hello. Meow. It's the new coat rack Ron bought for you. Give me my stuff. It's here. Check your, the book your father gave you. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, it's the same stuff. Even a tiny globe like this, Kanto and Alola seem awfully far apart. Who's this from? The autograph you got from Gym Leader and Kanto. They wrote, good luck. Gym Leader and Kanto? Who, I wonder who the hell that could be. They're showing a move on TV. The scene is showing four boys walking down a set of railroad tracks, but this time you get going. Oh, it's, uh, it's Stand By Me. Uh, it's a game console you can even take outside and play. It's a Switch. Snorlax Cushion. It's said to be so ruined. It's said... To be so ruinously comfy that you could waste away your whole life lazing about on one. Alright. So, uh, same thing. Nope, nope, skip it. Let's go. I want that, I want that, that spread set up and that, uh, that, that, uh, floor mat. Give me that. Hello. You were out like a light, weren't you? Even, you ought to be, uh, full of energy by now. And just look, it's already daytime here. It's supposed, uh, it's completely opposite of Kanto, but we are so far away here in Alola. So, Adam, are you excited to meet some Alolan Pokemon? Of course! <laughs> I wonder what would have happened if, if I would have just put, like, a, uh, I guess. That's right, I want to hurry up and meet some too. We're living in Alola region now, the beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. I'm sure Pokemon living in a place like this must be friendly, right? It might not be a bad idea to get out and see for yourself just how friendly Pokemon are here. Right, Adam, go and get ready for a bit of exploring. Your bag and hat and the things should be hanging in your coat, stand in your room. And didn't you leave a copy of your adventure rules on your desk, too? Oh, someone's sick. I don't know if you heard that. Coughing. Not the Pokemon. You checked your coat rack. Grab your bag and hat. Why couldn't I have done, why couldn't have I done that before? Snazzy. It's got... Gilgan ass hat. <laughs> Weird shit. What are they laughing at? So far, it's similar but different, which is, I mean, what we were expecting. Now, look, you're ready for anything. Oh, but even so, Adam, try careful walking through the tall grass. Still, I have to admit, I love my new Pokemon. I love to have new a new Pokemon around. Why don't you head toward Iki Town and see what you discover in Alola? Alright, I'm gonna kinda I'm gonna explore around here a bit. There's a whalemer pale, the ball shaped whale Pokemon. Cool. Anything here? Mouse painted dinner bowl, all the way from Kanto. Anything on TV? See my beauty, my elegance, see my adorable, precious little, little Pokemon. Camera, camera on the wall. Who's the cutest on the wall? If you want to show the world your style, your beauty, your cuteness, come to the Alola Photo Club. Oh, that's cool. Don't mind me, a new fridge bought here in Alola. 
just exploring around. What's in here? Meowth bed. Hardly been used since Meowth just sleeps in mo your mom's bed instead. Anything unique? Anything? Not really. Let's get to move on. Even though I know, like, almost what's going to happen in this game. I mean, I, I like, I, the basic, I know, I, know sun, I know Sun and Moon. I don't, like, uh, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon are going to be a lot different, I, I feel. There's going to be a lot, lot of, like, not just the, not just the, uh, the Krosma stuff, but, like, everything else. Whoa, look at that. No, Adam's house. It's your mom's beloved surfboard. She brought it all the way from Kanto with her. That's cool. Get your dad's car. What? Dad's car? Mom brought it along so he, she could use it to go out and run errands. Wait. So our dad... So our dad's still in Kanto. Is our dad a gym leader? Is our dad the gym leader that signed off on that autograph? It's over here. Hello, everybody. Route 1. Watch it, cuz. It's dangerous to get too close to a Pokemon while it's using one of its moves. Rough. Oh, they're, they're, uh, they're battling out there. Okay. Stay clear of that, everybody. It, it just looks so much more lively. Like, just look at that. Look at that Wingle. It's awesome. Oh, no entry. This area is under construction. Huh. Hello. Hello, young trainer. You can go with me. You can dash B. I'll take my song. Hiss. Okay, I get away from you, you weirdo. It's over here. Is that a jump spot? It's up here. Who's this? Who are you? Hello, my friend. The power of science is amazing. You can enjoy a festival with people from around the world without taking a step. Every day is a festival when you can do that. The cons are falling from the trees. Look at that wingle shot. That's pretty nifty. Can I... Oh, what? Something is coming at you from the tall grass. Oh, is this where we get our Pokemon? What's it gonna be? It's a young goose! Oh, it's pissed off. Yeah. Get out of here. Oh, here comes the rescue squad. Who? Bark, bark. <laughs> I'm trying to decide between Litten and Poplio because uh, last time I got a, uh, I got Rowlet. Yeah, yeah. Oh, cool! They saved my ass. Thanks, guys. Oh, who do I want? Hello, everybody. Oh, there's Kukui. Hi there, cousin. Hang on, I know you're right. You're Adam. Oh wait, hang on. I know you. You're Adam. I don't... Dude, I, I'm dyslexic when I read. You okay? I saw you attack... I, I saw you get attacked like that. You got a bit of help. Looks like you did. Though I, I sure didn't expect that, yeah? I didn't think these little fellas would dash out on their own to help uh, save a stranger. But I guess I'm getting ahead of myself. Welcome to the little uh, Pokemon Paradise. That's where I'm supposed to say anyway. I'm Kukui, yeah, the Pokemon Professor. People in Pokemon live together, work, uh, live and work together here in Alola too. Don't you ever forget that. You can go anywhere, yeah, as long as you've got your Pokemon. You and your, uh. <laughs> I need a drink. Uh, wild Pokemon can be lurking in, the lurking in the tall grass. Yeah, just waiting to leap out and bite you. But it'll be fine if you got a po Pokemon or a partner of your own. Let me take a sip of tea. Here. Even the, uh, even the music sounds different. Is this Kukui's normal theme? This sounds different. Hey there. Here, let me introduce the Pokemon that helped you just now. The grass type Pokemon Rowlet. The fire type Litten. And the water type Pokemon Poplio. What? Who should I get? You see, the fact of the matter is, when these Pokemon will become your first partner. Woo! <laughs> what was that face? Hey, huh, maybe that's why they wanted to save you. Go on and choose the one you'd like to keep as a, your partner, cousin. 
Oh, so, okay, so the entire thing was like, so the entire thing with the, uh, the, the going to the Iki Town Festival has been, like, bypassed. So this, because before it took, like, like, it took forever to get your, get, get to the point where you actually got to choose your starter, because you had to do the, you had to, you had to walk over to Iki Town, you had to talk to everybody, you had to go to the, the ruins or whatever, and then Top of Coco comes and that cutscene. It's a, it's a long process to get, actually get to the, the point where you can actually get, you can choose your starter. That's cool. Which one do I want? I'm not going to do Rowlet. I, li I like Decidueye and Rowlet and, uh, and, uh, and Dartrix. But I, I, let, I did that last time. I don't, I don't want to do that again. So it's between Litten and Papio. I mean, Incineroar is pretty dope. I like Incineroar. But I think Poplio, uh, I think Poplio, uh, I mean, I like popular, I, uh, Poplio, I like its evolutions. And I think it kind of, it kind of gets a bad rap. I'm trying to think. I, I think Poplio would be good. I don't know, what do you guys think? I'm not, I'm not going to, I'm not going to stop it here, but I'm just trying to, I'm just talking to myself. What's Litton or Poplio? Litton or Poplio? Um, I'm gonna go Poplio right now. Why not? Because there there are a lot of water types here, and if I choose Litten, I'll get screwed. Let's go with Poplio. What? Poplio works hard and makes some pretty awesome balloons. So you want to go with the water type Pokemon Poplio? Yes. Woohoo! Oh, let's go Poplio. That's awesome. Awesome. It's so cool. Poppy is awesome. You chose Poppy. I'm gonna give it a nickname. What should I name it? Yes, I would like to give a nickname to Poppy. What should I name you, buddy? How about. What should I name Poplio? Uh. Hmm. What should I name this thing? Well, it's, it's gonna it's going to be a male pre-marina. Should I name it? Should I name it? Should I name it Fabio? I don't know. It sounds like a <laughs> Let me think here. It's it's always it's always a uh, pain trying to name these things. Because if I get an Alolan Doug Trio, I'll, I'll probably I don't know. I, okay, yeah. You know what? You know what? You are not Fabib. Damn it, Fabio. <laughs> awesome. Hopefully this isn't too loud. It's been a while since I've done this. So you went with Poplio. Woo, what a fine looking team you two are. Now that, now that you can have Pokemon Battles, you are what you're what we call a Pokemon trainer. Here's a Pokeball for Poplio too. It should feel nice and cozy in there. Cool. Alright, let's get going up to Iki Town, Adam. Woo! Time to meet the Alan Kahuna. Alan Kahuna? The, the truth is, that partner Poplio of yours is a gift from the Kahuna, not me. So let's go show it off and say proper thank you, cousin, to... Uh, it may not be the only gift you get. Cool. In case you haven't heard, the Kahunas are crazy strong Pokemon trainers. Be careful about getting into battle with one. Alright, Fabio, let's go. The town is right up here. Cool. Cool, cool. Get Poplio there and that Pokeball I gave you. Can I, can I keep him out? I'd rather keep him out. I mean, it'd be, it'd be cool if it was just like the front Pokemon on your team. Get popular and then Pokemon gave you. Blah, blah, blah. Alright, let's check it out. Let's check out and see what we got here. We got Pokemon Refresh already, apparently. I, I don't remember getting it right off the bat. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know, I know. Pokebeans. You can groom them. 
You can do that, yeah, I know. Do, do I have any beans? Oh, I have a few. Awesome. Can I touch your nose? Give you a blue one, too. Cool. Cool. All right, what else? I'm, I'm gonna try to get these uh, these uh, new uh, these new reminders off of my bar here. Oh, cool! Five thousand dollars, nice. Do I have anything in the way of items? I do not. Cool. Let's uh, let's check out um, let's check out Fabio's stats, shall we? Ooh, even the uh, I just noticed that. Like uh, even the the uh, layouts uh, snazzier. It looks looks a lot a lot a lot more vibrant. Ooh, oh this is this is a good pop Leo. It's got it's got uh, it's got high special attack. My ooh, that's good. I, I got I, oh, I made a good choice here. Fabio's gonna be great. Fast and high special attack. Hell yeah. Uh, what are my, uh, what are my options, uh, set to tech speed, normal? Actually, the normal's pretty fast. It's actually pretty good. I like that. Okay, good. I do not mind that speed at all. Usually it's slow as molasses. Alright, let's, uh... Alright, we're about to go into some tall grass. And here it comes. What's it gonna be? Whoa, the music! Whoa, the intro! That's awesome! Oh, look at the background! Whoa! Light. Water gun. Let's cream him. It's a lot smoother too. Is it? Is, is it just me or is it a lot? Is it a lot smoother looking? What? The, what did they do to uh, enhance this? Yeah. I think I'll get to level 6 and then move on to Iki Town. Sounds like a plan to me. Whoa! I, lo I love the drum! It's like dun 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 and then it, then it leads directly into the uh, track. Oh, there's a Caterpie! Uh, ca did, I, did I say Caterpie? I meant to say Caterpie? Yo, I, I love the way, like, everything's just more lively. Hopefully this isn't too loud. Yeah, let me see if I can turn it down just a tad. Get it, get it to 60. Take that. Bam. Get the level six, and I'll move on from this spot. So we got a so we got a young goose and a caterpie. That's pretty cool. I've heard they've uh, they've uh, they've given some Pokemon buffs. They're a lot more they, like even Pokemon from Sun and Moon got buffs. Oh, there's Baneera here. That's cool. Whoa, wait! Did you guys see that? The the, the throwing animation. The throwing animation smoother. Dude, this is ultra. Like just just little things like that. Like it's crazy how you notice those. Pound. Ow. That's nuts. Cool, level six. Nice. Cool. All right, moving on to Iki Town. Let's get this ball rolling. Dirty looking rock. Hello. You win Pokemon Battle with the, when another Pokemon is out of energy. When HP hits zero, in other words. The items over here. They wouldn't just put a random stretch here without any items, would they? Ooh, 
We can win this. We can win this. Just a little bit more. Meowth, you scratch. Snar. Meow. Yeah. We can win this. We can get a little bit more. Oh, they both say the same thing. Oh, well. Stop. End it. Route one. The number one route in the spectrum. I'm just going to go over here to see if it triggers anything. No. Trainer tips. Pokemon gain experience points. Yep, yep, yep. I know this. I am an experienced trainer. Hello. If you happen to pick up a potion anywhere, use it on your Pokemon. It's low on HP. Don't mind if I do. Oh, crap. It's another Caterpie. Get out of my face. Can't, I can't believe I wasted two hours trying to find the stupid cord. <laughs> oh well. Holy crap! I, I might get your. I might catch a Caterpie for my team. Who knows? Try out different things. I'll pound you. Like, everything just looks a lot smoother in animation and, like, it's more polished. Which is interesting, like, what was the deal with, with like, was Sun and Moon, like, what was, like, what was their reasoning behind this? Besides, because, because, like, I don't know. Why, why couldn't they have released this first? Did they need more time? Did they have Sun and Moon finished and they needed more time to, like, was there something, I don't know. We'll find out, we'll find out. Let's see. Oh, shit, what the hell? Who the hell are you? It's how? Who the hell are you? How's it going, Hal? Hey, hey. Which Pokemon are you going to use as your partner? Have you decided? Oh, yeah. I'm Hal. I couldn't wait for us to pick our partners together, so I came to find you myself. Wow. Whoa, your Pompilio is so cool. Hey, wait. You already picked your Pokemon? Sorry about that, Hal. We had a little accident on the way here, so I ended up letting Adam choose his Pokemon partner without you. Fair enough. I guess it was fate, you guys, too. Uh, what did it mean? Wait, you could choose one of these two. How? Who's going to choose the, uh, the, uh, Litten? Partner will be Litten. I choose you. Hello, my friend. I've decided ages ago that you're the one I wanted to have an adventure with. We're going to do so much awesome stuff together. Just wait and see. I can see him having an Incineroar. They're very... They, they work well together. Professor, take care of Rowland, right? You better believe it, Hal. And he's going to use that Rowland when I fight him in the Elite Four. Spoiler alert. All right, then. Every, Rowland, everybody, time to get back in your balls for now. Wait up. Me and Litton have a favor to ask. Be our opponents for our first battle together. Yeah, let's do it. Hold on before you step into the ring. Let's make sure Poppy was up to it. Oop, nice and healed up now. Thank you. Let's go. All right. I'm seriously going to enjoy this. Oh, yeah. Pokemon Trainer How? Send out Lynn. His theme's different, too. I can, I can tell. I can, I can hear those little subtle changes. I'll probably one-shot him with Water Gun. Like, calling it now. I'm, I'm going to one-shot him with Water Gun. <laughs> like, this is going to one-shot you. Almost. I, I was almost correct. Oh, no. Th th did I get tea drip drippage on my, uh, my screen? Oh, no. I, I would have been so upset if I wouldn't have been able to find an, a uh, micro-USB. Because, uh, I, I, I worked, like, if, if you're seeing this on YouTube right now, like, I, I've, I, I made a really cool, I made a fancy layout. Like, I got I'm, I'm a little bit better at Photoshop, so, like, my layout's a little, a little bit more polished than the old one for, I, I used for Moon. But, like, it's, ba it's, I basically just took the one I used for Moon, and then I took out all the Lunala and the Pokemon Moon, and I changed the background, and I made it a lot more fancy, and it, it's really nice looking. I hope you enjoy it. You'll prob there's probably still some slight, like, uh, screen 
uh, like, I probably do adjust the screen, but I'm just too lazy to do it right now. Our first defeat. Sorry, Linton. $100 for winning. How are you poor as fuck? 100 bucks, man. And you're, you're the grandson of the Kahuna? Whoa, that was awesome, Adam. You and your poppy look so great, too. I don't know where I got great out of that. <laughs> you gotta have the kind of battles where everybody has, or everyone has fun. You and your Pokemon, part, you and your partner, ugh, you and your partner Pokemon, too, you know. Right on, Adam. You and Hal both brought out the best in your Pokemon and pulled off some, some, uh, some spectacular moves. Yeah. Iki Town is right up those stairs. Come on, Adam. Let's go. You should totally check out Iki Town. Will do, buddy. <gasps> there's, a, there's a shiny item over there. I'm getting attacked. I know for a fact I'm getting attacked. Yep, there it goes. It's going to be something I haven't seen before, too. I bet, I bet you. I bet you it's something I haven't seen before. Oh, no, it's, it's a Caterpie. I've seen at least two, two of those. Two or three of those. I, I want to know how they did it. How, how did they... How did they, they... They better optimize the system for this somehow. Like, the engine is just a lot more polished, it seems. Which is, which is crazy. As, as many lag issues as, uh, po like, Sun and Moon had... The fact that they were able to release this a year later, it's, it's interesting. Go into Iki Town. Iki Town. Even this is different. I don't know if that that like nice like drum rhythm was there before last time. And here we are, and we're here. This right here is Iki Town. I'm going to try to read what they're actually saying instead of inserting my words and saying what they, like, I don't know. It's, I don't know why I do that when I read. This town is where folks come to worship the Pokemon that watches over Mele Mele, Mele Island. Tapu Koko keeps us all safe and happy, see? Question mark? Looks like the Kuna is nowhere to be found, though. I guess there must be some trouble somewhere on the islands that needs fixing, yeah? Yeah, the Kahuna wandered off without a word to anybody, singing a little ditty or something. I'm going to stop by home for a sec. I've got to show my mom Linton. Woohoo! I will be exploring the town. Hey, I've got an idea for you, Adam. If you head through the village and up the hill, you can visit the room that belongs to Tapu Koko. That's our island guardian, island guardian deity, yeah? Why don't you go in and introduce yourself? If you're really lucky, maybe you'll actually get a glimpse of the guardian deity yourself. I'll stick around here and wait to see if the Kuna comes back. Cool! Iggy Town, the place where we give thanks to Pokemon. What's up, everybody? If you treat your Pokemon wrong, the Guardian Deed will strike you down with lightning. But the children all laugh when I tell them that. I want to meet the Guardian Deity. Maybe I should raise some mist cause some mischief for a Pokemon. Uh, no. You, you will die. Welcome to Iki Town, the town watched over by Pokemon. Hey, you've got a Pokemon. I want one, too. Where do you get yours? Ruff. Do you hear that? Caterpies. Caterpies and, uh, Pikapex. Hello, everybody. I am breaking and entering. How are you doing? Opening a window lets the night come creeping in. If you leave one open, it'll make you sleepy. Oh, on a lovely, calm day like this one, I always think of my brother. When we were young, he always worked so hard to collect sand from the beach. Where could he be now? What must he be doing? Uh, I'm assuming that was foreshadowing. We're going to be seeing that brother. He's probably just like some random, maybe a random NPC that gives me soft sand or something. Who knows? Hello. My Rock Ruff is the best bodyguard ever. She always comes to me when I go shopping and she lies outside my door when I sleep. Hell yeah. Good job. Hello. Rock Ruff there was a wild Pokemon when we got her, but now she's like part of the family. When I see her roughhousing with my little girl, I can't help but smile. Alright. Boom. I believe there's another building over here, and then we'll go see Tapu Koko. We'll probably trigger the cutscene with Lily. Hello. It is said that ancient peoples rode over the waves and seized together with their Pokemon to settle in the Alola region. 
Different people interact with Pokemon in their own different ways. Some may see them as allies in battle, while others just enjoy sharing their lives with them. Ooh, you see that uh, the nice uh, certain board up there? Pokeball shaped? That's pretty cool. Let's go. Caterpies. Anything, in the, anything I can do over here? No? No? Wait, wait. Can I go back there? No. Ooh, look at this. I think even, think even that, that, uh, that's different. Kahuna Haala is the strongest Pokemon trainer of all, in all Mele Mele. There must be some trouble going down somewhere on the island that needs Kahuna's touch. But he said something about how it's time for old Hala. And off he went. And here's the uh, the platform. Don't forget to save if you want to remember everything. Blah, blah, blah. Kahuna gives us his wisdom and guidance. Teaches us how to live with our Pokemon. Ruins a conflict. Okay, real quick. I'm gonna... Oh! Oh, the save! Uh, is it the save thing moved? Yeah, they moved it. Would you like to save your adventure so far? Yes, I would. Saving data. Cool. Ooh, look at that. Nice uh, boogie board. Just in case my uh, batteries run out or something. My hollowed trail. Holy crap. Now this. This is a lively region. This is what Alola should be like. This is amazing. This this is beautiful. Going to pay your respects to the guardian deity. It's a fickle one, but I hope you meet it. Well. Can't wait. This is, now this it just it just looks so much better. Hello. Oh, there's Lily. There's Nebby. I know, I know. I'll take you to the ruins. So please stay in the bag. We could get in trouble if anybody sees you. Oh no, what's it gonna be this time? Steel, still, uh, Spiro. Little, little dipshits. Little jerks. Anything over here? Anything over here? No? Alright, let's go. Hello! Hey, what's up? <laughs> uh, what's wrong? Help! Save Nebby! Pew! Those spear are attacking it, but I'm not a trainer. I can't. Please save Nebby. I'll hear your Pokemon for you, so... Oh, wait. Am I, ac <gasps> am I actually going to be able to battle him? I am! That's cool. That's really cool. Hell yeah. This is awesome. This is... This is cool. You're going down, Spiro. Oh god. Luckily this isn't a no... Uh, luckily this isn't a Nuzlocke. Level 4, huh? Pretty tough. Must be a speed tie. Bam. Now this is this is how you should have bought, uh, got, like fought against them last time. You managed to chase off one Spiro. Oh no, there are still more. Please help save whatever you can, be, but be careful. Looks like they attacked me. Damage the plank bridge too. Get off of me, Spiro. You jerks. Oh, man. Do I get to battle them all? I want to battle them all. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. See you, everybody. Oh, here he comes. Bam.
Hell yeah. Whoa. This, this, this is always one of my favorite scenes in the game. Pew! Oh. Oh, thanks goodness. You tried using your power right again, didn't you? Oh, and Nebby, you know what happened last time you used it? You couldn't move for ages after that. I don't want you to see you like that again. No, shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nebby. I know you were just trying to save me at that time. And I couldn't even help you in return. I don't think Nebby cares. What? What is that? It's a, uh, it's a sparkling stone. A sparkling stone? It feels warm somehow. Hello. Please forgive me. I'm so grateful to you for helping us out of that dangerous spot. Who are you? Uh, I'm Lily, and I suppose the stone must belong to you. Thank you. Sparkling stone! You open up the key items, put in your sparkling stone away. Please, don't let anyone... Don't tell anybody about this, about seeing Nebby. It's, it's a secret, okay? Give me the bag, Nebby. Good luck getting that thing in the bag. <laughs> um, I'm worried we might get attacked again by some wild Pokemon or something. I know it's too much. I don't know if it's, it's. I know it's too much for me to ask, but do you think you could see us back to town? Sure. Let's go. Let's get back to town. And we're back. Oop. Oh, Adam, you already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah? Lily, I thought you were with the Kahuna. Kunhala? He said that he had something to attend to, so he left town on his own. I was just, um, take a little stroll up Mahalo Trail while I waited for him to return. And that's, and, th and that's how you met our new neighbor, Adam, huh? He just got to a lily yesterday. Help him find his way around, yeah? So you're also one of Professor's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. Kahuna Hala has returned. He's back. Our guardian's chosen one is back. One of the strongest Pokemon users in Alola. Here he comes. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. What's up, man? Have I missed something? There you are, Kuhina Hala. Was there some kind of trouble? Aha, I just got caught in the middle of some brawling rock rough, that is all. Sorry, Lily, what were you, you saying before? For some reason, I thought I saw Tapu Koko flying about. Oh, yes, Kuhina Hala. Nebby got attacked by some Spiro on Plank Ridge, and Adam here helped protect it. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall into the bottom of the ravine. And that's when the Guardian's guy, Guardian Deity swooped in to save them. Whoa, that's something you don't hear every day. Oh, and I, I, although it is said to protect us, our topical is rather, rather fit, fickle creature. Yet, our Guardian was moved to save you. Kukui, my boy, I think we have cause to celebrate. Drink of tea. Looks like we have a brave and kind new Pokemon trainer in this. I'm glad to meet you, child. I'm Hala, the Kahuna of Melma Island. Wobnook, uh, Lola, young Kukui, had told me of your coming. I'm glad we had the chance to meet today. And there's Cosmog. What's up, buddy? Get in the bag. Oh, when did you get out again? I know that Kahuna Hala and the Professor will keep you safe from any harm, but you should stay still in that bag and out of sight. You're safer that way. Maybe. Well... Seems to have taken a liking to you. I, I I read that Pokemon like it when you pet them or take care of them, you know? Alright, here's a lovely gift for me to help Adam make today special. I read that wrong. Oh, hey look, it's a uh, Rotom Dex. Pokedex is a real high-tech kind of tool, yeah, that can automatically record facts about any Pokemon that you meet. Your new pop Pokemon, your partner Pop Poplio is already registered. Oh yeah, so check it out. Trainer Passport. Cool. 
Well, you got to meet the coon at least. Ready to head home now, Adam? Hey, it didn't take an hour to get here. Yay. If you two can work in harmony with each other, you can go anywhere together. Nice. Can I go in the building yet? Oh, yeah. Adam, hold up a sec. What do you want now, Hal? What is it, Hal? Did you forget something? You are seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone before wandering off a little stroll and a, and a saying without a word, huh? Hmm. Would you be so kind as to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have there? Yeah, sure, man. Could it be? Tutu, isn't that? You were rescued by Tapu Hugo at the bridge, isn't that what I heard, Adam? That's when I got the stone. So even it d deigned to give you a stone. Perhaps you are here in a little, Adam, because this is where you're meant to be. Allow me to borrow the stone for now. For it not, I'll return it to you tomorrow evening. You have the makings of a brilliant trainer. I can see the light within you, too. You must do us honor joining in our Pokemon Fest or our po yeah, Pokemon Festival, whatever, tomorrow. First, I'll make sure you get home safe today, Adam. Lily, you two should come with us. Wouldn't you wouldn't want to go losing you twice in one day? You are that precious Pokemon of yours. Yes, I'll keep an eye on. Oh, <laughs> there he is. Oh, would you try to? Would you try? Would you not try to escape the very moment that you were told not to wander off? Hello, back home. Hello! We're back! I got a Poplio! Welcome back! So what did you think of Kahuna Hala? Oh look! You got your Pokemon with you! Marr! It came running out to help you? What a sweet little thing! Right there in Route 1! And it saved you! That's amazing! It must have been fate that you met! The two of you look great together! I feel happier just looking to pair you! Hello! Time jump. That was my chair. <laughs> the next day. What a stunning sun sunset. All right, today's the day. I'll finally unpack. What? Was that the doorbell? Let's see who it is. I know for a fact you're not going to unpack. What she unpacks? Oh, that was the big plot twist. Mom unpacks. Is it Kukui? Hey, what's up, buddy? Hey there, Adam. About time we set off for the festival, yeah. At first, I got something to teach you, you know? That you're not that you're a real Pokemon trainer? It's the most basic of all basics. Come on, to Route 1. And we're gonna capture some Pokemon. Have fun at the festival, sweetie. I'll, um, I'm sure you'll have a good time with your new Pokemon pal. Me and Meowth, be sure to unpack every last box here, you see? Somehow I doubt that, but I, I imagine they're going to change that to make you work to where you actually unpack everything. I love how this is just bam, bam, bam. It's it's like, what was the slog in the other games? This They're actually just going boom, boom, boom. All right, Adam, hurry it up, cousin. Pretend you're Pokemon and use agility. While well, he just leisurely scrolls down there. What am I going to catch? Are you, going to give me a, are, are you going to give me a Pokemon to catch? Or some Pokeballs to catch Pokemon with? Yeah, we're here. So you so you know that wild Pokemon some, will sometimes jump out in the tall grass. Yes. Now that you have a Poplio there, you can not only fight Pokemon, yeah, but you can also try to catch them. Woo! I'm going to show you how to catch a wild Pokemon, all right? Keep your eyes on the prize. I love how he's just a big professional wrestling reference. Oh, hey, it's a uh, Grubbin. Is he going to use this Vikavolt when I fight him in the uh, Pokemon League? I wonder. Holy crap. You gotta wake it up, Pokemon. Yes, I know this. Oh, 
Oh my god, he's got 50 Pokeballs. Dude, you are stocked up. Give me some of those. Cool. Can I have that? <laughs> Can I have that, Grubbin? Alright, got myself a Grubbin. Wild Pub One do sometimes attack people if they get close. They'll catch them and they'll join your team. It'd be a great help to you, yeah. And if your Pub One get tuckered out, you can always head out. You can always head home and rest a bit. Rest up a bit, huh? I mean, yeah. Here are some Pokeballs and potions to get you started. Cool. Ten Pokeballs. Hey, nice. Five potions. Great. It's uh, it's seven so far. Why don't you have a little adventure on your way to Eagle Town? On your of your own your way to Eagle Town. Take your care of Adam Pablo. Cool. Oh, kind of a kind of a sketch look over the uh, the corners here. You never know when they're gonna hide something from you. Let's see what we get. Give me, give me, give me. I want it. What is it? Oh, it's a grubbin. Cool. Yes. Give me that grubbin. I'm gonna pound because I'm afraid I'm gonna one shot this thing. Otherwise. Oh, it's, uh, it's actually pretty tough. Give me one more pound. I think... I don't know. Wait, let's try Pokeball. I think this should be enough. Come on, buddy. What am I going to name you when I catch you? You're, you're, uh, electric outlet Pokemon. I mean, you, you, you look like an electric outlet. You're a battery. So what should I name you? Cool, level 8. Nice. Oh, yeah. That special attack's going up. Disarming voice. Yes. Fairy type moves. Give me those. Cool. Grubbin's data. Add it to the Pokedex. Nice. Registered. If you find its nest, you should stick your hand in you shouldn't stick your hand inside. You'll get bitten by an irritated grubbin. I would like to give you a nickname. What should I name you? Let's see. How okay, you're a uh, you're you're a battery. You look kinda like an electrical outlet. What should I name you? I'm gonna call you you I'm gonna call you USB. Sounds good to me. USB. USB has been added to your party. Nice. Let's check them out. Oh, Pokemon Refresh. Let's check this out. People slamming doors. I can't wait for like. I mean, it's it's art. The game's already started to diverge a little bit. I can't wait for more divergences to occur. Looking forward to that. Hello, buddy. Hello, USB. Give you a yellow one. Whoa, that, whoa, these animations, they have these, it, they're definitely a lot smoother. Let's see, let's see. A trainer passport. Neat. Pokedex. Cool. 1% Pokedex. Oh, I'm going to check out uh, uh, Poplio's Pokedex entry. I don't think I've ever... Uh, I look, I've looked at that yet in this playthrough. It, the balloons that inflates with its nose grow larger and larger as it practices day by day. Cool. Con 
continuing. Is there anything else cool here that I can catch? Youngers? Would it be worth catching one of these? I wonder. I don't know. I mean, I do need Pokemon, but would it be worth catching a, a, a Young Goose right now? Hmm. Curious. I guess I should, really. The more, the merrier. No, not potion. Pokeball. And, and unless it's, let's not encounter something crazy. This will be the first po. This will be the only Pokemon I catch for now in this little area. Unless something crazy appears. Dun, 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 he looks so pissed. <laughs> Its stomach takes up most of its long torso. It's a big eater, so the amount trainers have to spend on food is no laughing matter. What should I name you? I'm gonna name you Looker. Damn it. Because when you evolve, you look like a detective. See what else I got here. Let's look at your guys' stats. Oh, that's kind of not good. Doubles the damage dealt to target's replacement to the, if the target switches up. Huh. Swarm. Luckily, you're not. You're you're more of a physical attacker, so you have a low special attack. It's not bad. But low attack, it's not. It's not optimal, but oh well, I'll, I'll work with it. I'll work with it. It's a uh, really an item. I think I'll do to get Looker up a couple levels. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. What's it gonna be? Is it the grubbin? Oh, level two too. I might actually be able to. Uh, actually, no. I'm gonna. I'm gonna pivot train. I don't wanna risk the biscuit. I'm gonna pivot train. That way, nobody gets knocked out. Go, Fabio. Disarming voice. Let's see what it. Let's see what it looks like. Damn. Ow. Cool. Level three. Awesome. I'll get looking at level. I'll get, I'll get both of them to level five before I move on. A Pokeball, nice, nice. Yeah, but I think that's a good idea. Get, get both Looker and USB to level 5 before I move on to the next area. So, I hope you don't mind a little bit of training. Fabio can take care of this Donald Trump lookalike. Water gun. Hopefully this one shots you. I would really appreciate it if this one shot you. It's not gonna happen. Ow. Eat this.
Level four. This is gonna be easy. I love that that, that drum, the, the little drum beat, like pump them. That, that, that's like it's such a small touch, but it really livens things out. I'm higher, but I'm still afraid this thing's gonna wreck me. So I'm switching out. Whoa, that thing hits like a truck. Water gun, please. Yes, one shot. Very nice. I might use a couple of potions here. Potion. I have plenty, so it doesn't matter. I think uh, after I uh, get, the, get, the, get them to level five and get up there to that little uh, hill, I think I may, I may save. Take a break. Ooh, a ladybug. I don't know if a ladybug will be worth getting though. I mean, I, mean, I, I didn't use a, I did not, I did not use a ladybug before, so maybe, maybe it'll be worth getting. Maybe they buffed it. I'll get a ladybug. I mean, right now in Oklahoma, uh, these things are like ladybugs are everywhere, man. It's pretty crazy. They're, they're like they're uh, they're like migrating, and they're they're apparently they're a nuisance. They're an invasive uh, species. It's pretty nuts. You, you'll see like little uh, little yellow ladybugs everywhere, just randomly. Oh no, my poor dog. What am I going to name this guy? Come on. Yeah, my laptop's power is getting kind of low. I think this is a good point to get it some rest. Lady Bubble, the add of the Pokedex. Hopefully Ladian is like buff. Like a buff Ladian. Or maybe, or maybe Ladian's got it all open for him. This Pokemon is very sensitive to the cold, and the warmth of the low load appears quite lively. Next. What should I name you? What should I name you? What should I name you? I love my book, book types, are my, some of my favorite types. So, what should I name you? Let's see. What should I name you? I don't know why, but I, I, I kind of want to name him Rocket. Or Comet. Hmm. Should I name you Rocket? Hmm. I don't know why. To me, this seems like a really good name for a, a Ladian. That's awesome. Rocket. Because it's the five star Pokemon. Stars. Rocket. Sun and Moon. Ooh, special attack and uh, special defense are alright. Early bird. Eh, okay addition to my team. Not bad. I think, I think another battle or so. We'll uh, get a we we'll get Looker to level five, and then I'll get USB to level five. And I'll and I'll see you guys later. Or should I capture this Caterpie? I'm gonna capture everything, man. I, I actually kind of want to capture this Caterpie. I'm on a bug type extravaganza right now. 
The bunk catching. I wish you would bring back the bunk catching contest. That was my favorite thing about one of my favorite things about uh, Gen Two. I mean, we're. we're I mean, uh, Alola has a history with uh, with Johto and Kanto, so I mean, they, they can do it. They can tie it in somehow. Caterpie, going to be a Butterfree. I wonder if there's an Alolan Butterfree. You know, you know that that alone makes me want to keep these Pokemon. Because I don't know, I I don't know. There's there, there's got to be new Alolan forms, and what what are they? What are they going to be? Is it going to be a Alolan, Alolan Butterfree maybe? Psychic Bug? That'd be great. Nice, nice, nice. Caterpie's data will be added to Pokedex. Registered. Perhaps because it would like to grow up quickly, has a voracious appetite eating 100 leaves a day. So two of my Pokemon are just fatties. Okay. I'll call you... I'll call you bye-bye. Because of bye-bye brother free. Saddest episode ever. Let's check him out. Or check her out. I think this is my first female Pokemon. It is! Cool. Uh, low special attack. That sucks. Oh well. Like, Poppy was good. And Grubbin's alright. And then, like, I, I don't know. I guess it really, it really doesn't matter. I just want to see what they do. I want to see uh, what they're what they're all about. Um, I'm gonna heal them up. No, restore. How many of these do I have left? Yeah, a few. It might be a waste, but I hope to train them eventually. All right. Switch you up. I'll get USB at level 5, and I'm, I'm going to uh, say goodbye for now. I will come back later, because I'm, I'm, I'm only taking a break. I'm not going to stop playing all together today. Another Ladian. I think USB can handle this. Nice grip. Oh, yeah. USB can definitely handle this. You see, because this is a revamped Pokemon Sun and Moon, it gives me incentive to keep these these root, these first route Pokemon because I don't know if they're going to be Alola forms. Come on, level five. I need to take a break. I need to go eat something. Charge up my uh, my DS and my computer. Another lady, well, I, I, I've been avoiding uh, spoilers on YouTube like a plague. <laughs> I, I've seen one image, one image so far in a thumbnail that kind of sort of spoils something for me, but I don't, I don't know the context of it. I know, I, I think I have an idea of what it is, but but, but I barely got a glimpse of it, and I just know it's it's a it's it's a Pokemon of some sort. It looks like, but but I didn't get a good. I didn't like when, when I realized it was a spoiler. Like it, it immediately clicked, and I looked away from it, and then I made sure not to go back to it again. So I I kind of remember what it was shaped like, but I don't remember much else. Hold on a second. Sorry. Oh, sorry about that. Awkward silence. Sorry, I, I was looking at a text. <laughs> Unprofessional. Take that lady ball. 
One more battle should do it. Just give me a second. Alright, alright. Next victim, please. Hopefully it's something different. I'm gonna catch something different, damn it. Oh, it's a piggy pack. Cool. I will capture you as well. I don't know if you know any uh, grass moves yet, but I, I don't wanna... Grass moves? Flying moves. But I don't, I don't, wanna, I don't wanna take the chance. I'm just gonna pound you. Yeah. I think it's at a good little uh, little health level there. Get in the ball, please. Yes, level five. Woohoo! Pick a pack, we added my. Crocodex. Sorry, burp. It's gross. Oh, forgive me. It pecks at trees with its hard beak. You can get some idea of its mood or condition from the rhythm of its packing. I'm gonna name you. I'm gonna be Piper. Peter Piper picked a pepper pick a bleh. I can't even say that. But yeah. Piper. Piper the pick a pick. Cool. I've got a whole team now. Let's see what you look like. Ooh, speed. That's good. He's got skill in too. Nice. But yeah, that's uh I think that's gonna be it for now, everybody. It for this episode at least. What I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna arrange these out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing some training. Get, I'm gonna get everybody to at least level five. Hope soon. And then I will we'll, uh, continue onward to Iki Town. I walk over here. Until next time. It's the Y Hand. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the works. Check out my Facebook and Twitter. And to everybody, peace out. <laughs>